subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates. Human rights, freedom of the press, resist. If you're in China, these are some of the words Apple won't engrave on your iPad for you. Apple, which is one of the biggest tech makers of our times, could be tilting towards a form of censorship in China, Taiwan and Hong Kong, according to research from Citizen Lab. It is not even clear why Apple is engaging in what Citizen Lab terms as censorship when the laws in Hong Kong and Taiwan don't even mandate it. The Citizen Lab, you might remember, is the lab based at Canada's University of Toronto and has helped Amnesty International and WhatsApp in separate investigations track the Pegasus spyware. So this particular censorship Apple is engaging in is related to its product engraving service. Apple has a service where you can have the exterior of your Apple device customized with a message and emojis. So, in an 18th August report, Citizen Lab showed how Apple won't engrave certain words in China, Taiwan and Hong Kong. Citizen Lab first gathered from various sources over 5 lakh keywords, including keywords censored on Chinese chat apps like WeChat and Sina UC, video streaming apps like YY and mobile games played in China. The research was done in May and June of this year. So this research looked at what keywords are filtered by Apple's engraving service in six regions, mainland China, Hong Kong and Taiwan. Then for context and comparison, the research also looked at what keywords are filtered in USA, Canada and Japan. Perhaps not surprisingly, Citizen Lab says, compared to its Chinese language filtering, we discovered Fewer restrictions on Apple product engravings in Japan, Canada and the United States. While all six regions had words that were censored and not allowed to be engraved on Apple devices, the most censoring happened in mainland China where researchers found 1,045 keywords were not allowed. Second highest censoring happened in Hong Kong and then Taiwan. United States had the least censoring, blocking only 170 words. The research categorized the banned words based on whether it is socially sensitive or politically sensitive. The socially sensitive words are those referencing explicit sexual content, illicit goods and vulgarity. Apple banned such words in all of the six regions. But politically sensitive words are only censored in China, Hong Kong and Taiwan. This graph shows how many banned words are socially and politically sensitive and how China is where the most words in both categories are allegedly censored. And what are the politically sensitive words Apple bans in China? The research says in mainland China, Apple widely censors political speech including broad references such as politics, resist, wave of democracy and human rights. In mainland China, Apple also heavily censors references to Tibet and Tibetan religion. Such keywords include Dalai and Dharamshala. Words censored in China include the Chinese words for human rights, freedom of press and double universal suffrage. The names of people that are not allowed to pass through by Apple are Ai Weiwei, the name of a political dissident, Chairman Mao, the founder of the Chinese Communist Party and Falun Gong, a name of a Chinese political religious group. The engraving 8964, a reference to the 1989 June 4th protests of the Tiananmen Square incident is also banned in China. Citizen Lab notes how Apple's public facing documents fail to explain how it derives their keyword list, so there is no clear indication of how these keywords are compiled. And Citizen Lab also adds, Apple has a heavy dependence on the Chinese market where almost a fifth of Apple revenue is generated and where the bulk of Apple devices are assembled. Citizen Lab says there are growing concerns over the leverage that China holds over Apple and criticism of how Apple proactively implements censorship to please the Chinese government in order for Apple to advance its commercial interests in the region. Apple had responded to Citizen Lab's request for comments saying about its product engraving service, we try to not allow requests which could represent trademark or intellectual property violation are vulgar or culturally insensitive, could be construed as inciting violence 
or would be considered illegal according to local laws, rules and regulations of the countries and regions where we personalize and where we ship. The print had emailed Apple to confirm whether Apple does censor certain words even when it is not required by the law as outlined by Citizen Lab Research and whether Apple censors any words from being engraved in India as well. But no response was received. Nonetheless, the rising trend of censorship companies may have to join to please governments is a concern for citizens. For the print, this is Regina Mihnu.